So this is the second uh, Wild Oceans episode that I filmed in the Sogod Bay in the Philippines. And this opening shot shows you just how beautiful some of the reefs can be. And those are all damselfish and basslets swimming across the reef. And it's actually on the top of the wall. And right in the beginning of the dive, I came across this guy. Uh, he's a hawksbill turtle. And a lot of people have trouble telling the difference between a hawksbill turtle and a green turtle. Uh, first of all, the shape of the head is very much like the beak of a hawk. And also their shell uh, the edges of the shell is normally jagged, whereas a green turtle has a much smoother edge to the shell. I'm down on the wall now and those are black and white snappers and that was a juvenile that just passed through the frame. And you can see just how healthy the wall of the reef is. Look at this sea fan covered in feather stars. And if you look closely on the wall you can find all kinds of critters and this is a giant frogfish which I came across. Uh, often known as anglerfish. Uh, so called because of the fishing lure they have hanging off the front of their head. It's a little bit hard to see in this shot but it is there. He's called a giant frogfish, and they're different shades of grey and sometimes red. Anyone who dives a lot in the tropics will know what this guy is. He's a juvenile yellow boxfish. And when they're juvenile, they're very skittish and they're actually quite difficult to film. Uh, but I followed him for a little while, enough to get a good shot, and then I left him in peace. And when they become adults, uh, they get actually quite a lot bigger and the coloration changes to a blue mottly pattern. This is a school of striped catfish and when they're juveniles uh, they school together like this. Safety in numbers I guess you would say. And they swarm up and down the reef looking for things to eat. And I was filming these guys at about 15 meters Now I can't let a single episode go by without giving you a few shots of one of the many different kinds of anemone fish that live in the Sogod Bay. And this guy's a tomato anemone fish. Uh, it's called the Sogod Bay. It's in southern Leyte, about one hour's flight from Manila and then a two or three hour bus or taxi drive down to Padre Burgos 